So I want to talk a little bit about Jerry's apartment because there's actually a recent recent meme that I've been seeing um, about how Ooh. Jerry's hallway oh. cannot exist. What? Uh, somebody like took his apartment and like extended his hallway and you can see it goes right into his kitchen. Let me, let's. Well, why can't it go just around? But it, but it doesn't. When you, when you look, when, when they show Jerry in his hallway, it's a straight hallway. Huh. I can't tell what part's facing what. I don't know. Oh, the, I see. Okay, so the, the front door is right there next to your shoulder, next right. to your arm. But um, here, let me just get out of the way. By give it be like a be like a weatherman be like a weatherman yeah. and like yeah. so as you yeah. can see right here Jerry's door goes out to this uh, goes out to this oh I see the Doesn't hallway work. of the apartment complex right. I get it yeah very yeah. interesting yeah you're right go the other way yeah very so I guess there's this this is this some dude built this little model. And this is his, his, his thesis is that Jerry's hallway could not exist in real life. Wow. This is, this is very depressing. Wow. It's like, well, no, that just means that it's like sci-fi. It's like, it's, <laughs> it's like the, the Doctor Who. It's like the TARDIS, right? Yeah, yeah. exactly. Ryan gets it now yeah. that he's seen Doctor Who. Now, remember, there's always supposed to be a Superman thing, you know, in every episode, right? Jerry likes to have Superman, and I think he, he was in the bookshelf mm -hmm. before. I didn't look for him in this episode. Right. So, I don't so know this book, there. this bookshelf was missing mm -hmm. in this episode. The bookshelf yes. right here. Yes. That I'm touching with my finger. Yes. So maybe there wasn't a Superman in that one episode, but anyway, so like maybe this was some weird like DC comics superman special hallway that was created by you know some thing maybe maybe this was a sci-fi show i think it was a a, a filming set hmm. <laughs> that they that they that they filmed on in and los it angeles <laughs> it wasn't practical yeah well, you have your I theories i have mine i think it was at cbs studios wasn't it ryan didn't you know that um yeah i visited it or at least, no, I went to the outside and was it CBS or was it NBC? I think it was CBS. It was NBC shooting at CBS. If I, I think that's what right. it was. That's how they, they're all, they're all in bed together. All those, those guys. Yeah. So uh, what other differences did you notice, Kat? I mean, and, and don't say it wasn't, it just wasn't as funny. Cause that's just hurtful. well, it wasn't. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's kind of that's that's without you don't have to even say that because that's obvious. So. I just yeah, like I said, the pacing was a lot slower, and mm. Jerry's character was I don't know he just he was so much different. Um, like you said, he was so much more of the nice guy, and um, that's just not kind of who he was. You know, like I feel like the Seinfeld characters are known for being like horrible people like mm -hmm. that's right. what the shtick is right mm -hmm. and it came off as like they were like nice people <laughs> that but was I, the most glaringly obvious thing to me like caring about the girl like sleeping mm -hmm. in um in her in the living room instead of the bedroom you know like that was so why even give her a chance <laughs> jerry the funniest, the funniest thing was when george says he says, uh, you might as well invite another man to be with her. <laughs> like, you're going to put another bit. What do you, you might as well invite another dude or however he worded it. But that was a, that was a funny line there. I thought. Yeah. And I'm reminded of the time that Jerry said, well, I don't want to be a pirate. <laughs> I don't know why. She was a low talker. <laughs> <laughs> 